Hello viewers. So today we are here to discuss one more topic. Can aspirin or the blood thinners dissolve the clot in the brain or not? So as you all know, blood clot in the brain commonly causes paralysis where people get weakness of one hand and one leg. Many times they lose the speech. So it's a disabling disease. And if left untreated, almost 30% of people may not survive also. So routinely medicines are given to treat stroke patients and many times the aspirin or another blood thinner called as clopidogrel. So these are the two common blood thinners routinely given to patients with stroke uh, for the treatment. And many times people feel that these are blood thinners so they will dissolve the clot. But the correct answer is that aspirin or clopidogrel, the commonly used blood thinners, they do not dissolve the blood clot. There is only one medicine which can dissolve the blood clot and that is called as intravenous thrombolysis or commonly called as clot buster therapy. Now this therapy is time bound. What I mean by time bound is that from the onset of stroke symptoms till the time this injection is given, it should not cross four and a half hours in most cases. There are exceptional cases where this treatment can work beyond that period also, say maybe six to eight hours. But routinely these injections work only in the first four and a half hours and only two medicines have been approved as the clot buster drugs. One is the TPA that is tissue plasminogen activator altiplase and the second is tenetiplase. And these are both injections uh, as I mentioned they are time bound they work only in the first few hours after the stroke onset. Now once people lose that window period and come to the hospital after four and a half hours then whatever injections or tablets are given, they are only to prevent the next stroke. So some people may receive heparin injections if there is a clot in the heart because that clot can again travel to the brain. So such patients may receive heparin injections. So that is to prevent the clot from traveling from heart to the brain. And many other patients, most patients are given aspirin or clopidogrel or combination. And the purpose of that is to prevent new clots in the brain. So I hope it was clear and uh, so the my final remarks or conclusion is that if you notice any patient who has stroke like symptoms like difficulty in speaking, the face going to one side or weakness of arm or leg or imbalance while walking, then rush to the nearest hospital with where they have a CT scan facility so that the stroke can be diagnosed correctly and the clot buster drug therapy can be given at the earliest possible time. Thank you.